Welcome back to the final fight as we try to take down Garvin in this crazy tank. Um, this is not going to be a fun, ooh, 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 I'm making jokes video. This is going to be a we are playing the damn game video because I don't think I have the resources to win this fight. I don't think I have enough in me to take down 360 HP Garvin and a potion. Luckily, enemies don't know how to use a potion or else I'd be really, 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 really not in a good place right now. So let's see how this is going to go. Uh, I wish there was some sort of delimiter to tell me if somebody's boosted. But we are going to boost... Boost up. Walt. It's kind of sad that you've been sort of reduced to this rule in this battle, Hazuki. Um, I did kind of bring you here because I was like, oh, maybe that'll help uh, Penko be a useful character. Uh, so what we're going to try to do here is we're going to try to pull him down and sort of create a situation where he's got two... We have two Giga Breakers up here, uh, which I cannot deal with on top of him. And my hope is to sort of pull this into a one-on-one -on -one fight so only one person is taking damage. Unfortunately, that person is Pappet. And I don't really want Pappets to be that person, but that is the unfortunate scenario here. Now this Minotaur is confused. We're gonna have David come up and take a shot at this Bow Knight here. Now David has a, an increased attack, but yeah, I think it's about to wear off. All right, so these guys are coming in and we're hoping that they just kind of get stuck. I can't believe you didn't attack, Bone Knight. What are you doing? So, here's my options. I can come here and attack this Bone Knight and be done with him. I can also come here and attack this Minotaur and be done with him. Uh, what is your support? I don't know what it is. I have to assume it's not defense. So I'm going with the Attack this Minotaur and be done with him strategy. I might not even be done with him, honestly. Alright, Welcome Bolt. You're gonna give me a crit. I'll be done with him. Good. 64 damage. Alright, so here comes Mad Garvin. He's gonna attack. Oh no. That's gonna leave you with 1 HP. That's not what I was hoping for. Also, I would just like to point this out. David has the Everyone Recovers MP item. I was kind of hopeful that David had the Everyone Recovers uh, HP item. So we could use that and that would be useful to us. Um, because in addition to this fear that I have that I'm not going to be able to do enough damage, um, I also have this fear that I'm not going to be able to heal enough. What do you have for items? Well, you got a medical herb. That's not terrible. So, I'm hoping to, with Pappet, um, we're going to kind of hold him here with Pappet. But I kind of want to slowly pull him back. So maybe that he ends up hitting Walt or something. Um, and the more I pull him through here, the more I can sort of uh, send in my Harpy and send in my Wyvern to do some damage. No. But, is it even worth it to heal you? No, I, it's not even worth it to use it on the Harpy. But it's probably worth it to do, uh... Get that Wyvern full up. 
Uh, because I I, I, I I genuinely think this crab is... I'd, I'd love this crab just to take a hit. Meanwhile... Now, here's... Unfortunately, we're going to be engaged in this, like, life and death struggle. And, you know, we're going to come over here, and it's just going to be, like, whatever. Like, this is not... Gary, this is not worrisome at all. Um, so the Bow Knight can't get down there. This Pegasus Knight can get down here barely. So we have the Giga Breaker. Let's just deal with the Giga Breaker. I'm sure this freeze won't kill it, but this freeze will soften it up. And, you know, should I should I have Mask and kill it? Um, because our levels even get- do I even care about levels? Oh, okay, you're on a zero effect. Terra? Get in, you know what? We're not gonna get to do a lot of fancy editing. But you know what we're gonna get to do in this video? That we're not gonna get to do for a lot of it? Do 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 do. This is our happy time spot, where there's no stress. Crowtop lever. So do. No, with Merkel Krokop's in the fight again, going Oh, he's got a lever oh, kill! Lever it's over and up! Um... This is our happy, stress-free place. Now let's see if we can pull back slightly... ...with what we have, sort of restore our formation. This is the first time in... ...what feels like a very long time... ...that I'm doing, what, a, a double recording in a day. Usually I just play for, you know, half a day, uh, and that's it. And come back. Uh, but we are actually doing a double recording today because I am, like, into this battle. Just do moving some things around on my screen. Uh, Garrosh, you, are you, are you the most useless person on my force? No, pen coexists. So, uh, uh, we gotta think while we're doing this, what's gonna be on our alternative our, and our alternative strategy if we can't get through Garvin? And I think it's really simple. I think we just, you know, try to recruit some better beasts for Apex. Honestly. I, I, I think it's that simple. We just need to recruit some better stuff. Uh, oh, don't look at healing items. I think it's really that simple, because if I replace that harpy, if, honestly, if I replace that harpy with another wyvern, or I replace the crab with a wyvern, I don't think I'm stressed at all. Well, I'm still stressed, but I don't think we are um, in the shape that we are in currently. Now, 26 agility. So you will go before the Bow Knight, and you will go before Garvin. So you will not do anything. Mm, not worth healing. Are we just gonna chill? I think we're just gonna chill. Alright, we have a healing drop. We're gonna use that. Now my fear is that we don't we can't take a hit here. Oh, okay. You also recovered the 2 HP. So I think I want you here. Because when I pull Pappets back, I'm going to want uh, a unit with good defense to come in and take his spot. At least for a bit. So you are better than walls to be here. Um... I need a big hit. I need a crit. Give me something good, David. So that basically, that means I've done four damage to him this turn. Oh, you're taking out the poor scissor crab. Well, it's good that I use that herb. Goodbye, scissor crab. I mean, that might be good in a sense of, I don't know how you guys stay the, the freak away. I don't know how this recruitment goes. Well, I might be able to, uh... 
I I'm just thinking how I can deal with that bow knight. Uh, I need a crit here, Walls. I need good. A crit with your super high attack. 52 damage. So we did about 60 damage this turn. Which it isn't even that good. Oh, you did a counter. Good for you, Pappets. So we ended up doing about 80 damage this turn. Um, and 80 damage is not bad at all. So I don't want to pull this guy down. And I don't think I'll pull him down if I move my Wyvern here to deal with this Bow Knight. But my question is, um, I'd rather use my Harpy to do it. My Harpy has 23 agility. My Wyvern has 18, so... Hmm... Well, it's only going to be one of you that gets a hit in on I'm I'm a little worried about that, but I also don't need you. Deviating from the plan. We don't deviate from the plan. Deviating from the plan is a mistake. But... I think... I think that was a good turn for us. I think we did around 80 damage to, to Garvin, and I think hitting 80 damage on Garvin is a good thing. If I can get around the Medean taking hits, I'll, I'll get around the Medean taking hits. That's why I moved back, because I assume you're going to come in full force. I'm going to go right at Hera. Oh, you're a crit. That's why we moved Medea. Um, the the idea of if, if Pappets wants to keep countering, like that's huge for us, because uh, that's kind of like the the little extra damage that we need. Oh, you're just gonna stay in place? I guess you just showed up. You got no real rush. And I mean, honestly... Things just need to die right now. There's no such thing as XP share. Uh, so we need to get... A heal in here. You can come right up. Can you come right up? Yeah, you can come right up. It's a bow knight and, uh... Two Giga Breakers, they're not going to make it up here to do anything that really matters to you. Well, already 13 minutes has gone by in this recording. Hey, nice, your Rindo got a level up. We got Aura 2 last level, so we can't get too greedy here. Um, I think the low-key, possibly worst part of this is... Loki possible worst part of this is I might not finish this battle one way or the other by the end of this recording. So we have Garvin at 271, that's not great. Abbott still has a healing healing rain, healing drop. Uh, so I'm gonna use a goddess tier, Bahizuki, to get her more attack buff spells. Uh, Pappets is going to heal, and our other two guys are going to hit. Uh, the question is, what do I do with the Wyvern? I'm not going to engage the Wyvern yet. 33, well, that's pretty good. Um, we're not going to engage the Wyvern yet, and we're not going to engage the Harpy yet. Because I want to know if I can pull them back uh, to David. You stay put. Alright, David, we need crits. We need crits. We need big damage. Ugh. That was not big damage. Waltz. We need big damage, buddy. We need crits. That's not a crit. 
39 damage. David becomes a partner. I don't know what your supports are. Um, so, what does that give us? Um, you want to do a counter, Pappets? Oh, Pappets. Um, that only gives us about a damage output of... Yeah, how does that help me? How does Pappets running back help me at all in regards to, to doing damage because I'm just thinking I want to get Pappets back here so he's attacking here but I'm still going to be attacking here and I'm still going to be getting doubled up on. Alright so 220 so we did about we, we did not do enough damage to him this turn. Um, long story short. Alright so here comes a Pegasus Knight the never-ending amount of guys, but this is just a pullback. Get your formation in tight, in tight, and uh, just chill. That's all this one is. I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop because uh, I remember fighting the Titan and thinking I was doing really damn good in that battle. And then all of a sudden the Titan shows up. Which just, you know, wrecked us. And I'm waiting for that. Hey, this thing has shown up to start wrecking us. Thing to start happening. Alright, so we are at full full bore right now. Apex has 42 defense. So David should actually tank hit slightly better. Um, the question's really gonna be, and I'm actually gonna drop a save here. I know I usually don't do this, I like to just kind of whatever what happens, cut. Um, I'm a little worried that if I move Pappets back, I'm not gonna get the buy-in that I want. Um, I'm also going to attack up this Wyvern, because why not? I mean, I only have so many casts of stuff. And I should start getting conservative, but... See, I was gonna say, but I do have Goddess Tears, right? Uh, that I can chain off. But, those Goddess Tears, I have to use my unit to get them to use them. So I can bring Pappets back, and you're gonna chill out, Pappets. Covers 2 HP, you are here to use a healing drop on Pappet. I could also put- see, the thing is, I could also replace Pappets with a Liver. Oh, you know what? I could push David up here. Putting him in melee range as well. Uh, if I push David up, I can keep Waltz here. And I can put Suzuki here, and I can start. That might be what we're gonna do. We're gonna push David up. Um, I think that might be the decision to make. Because I, I don't think I'm gaining anything by pulling him back here. Oh, I don't know if this is what I want to do, but... Oh, 24 damage. I need to get more damage. Alright, do I want to move Waltz up? Um, no, because remember we wanted to slot Bazooki in there. Um, and everyone's to- oh, good, good Waltz, good Waltz. Yes, nice. So that's 52 damage, so he's going to be down to about- Alright, Waltz's attack is gone. And that sucks. Good, this is not regret hit. Good. David could take that. David could theoretically take another hit. Um, here's the question. These guys have gone. Agile 20. Agile 20. Ag Do I want to come in here with the Wyvern? Do I want to do this? Because this is committing. And I'm pretty sure that Wyvern dies when I commit here. 
<clears throat> Getting greedy. 38 damage, though. Um... I guess the best way to put it is I can see the end. Uh, do I want to slowly pull back a bit? Campbell's not the one who's slowly pulling back. It's the casters who are the ones who are slowly pulling back. Zero, you can move around. Bernard, you can pull back. Alright, now you guys are coming. Now, what we might have won is uh, everybody. Bow Knight comes. Are we now going to engage that Bow Knight? I think we're now going to engage that Bow Knight. Still waiting for the other shoe to drop. I'm hoping... I'm hoping I can get another hit in with that Wyvern. Ooh, nice! Robbie's arrow skills just went up. I am hoping I can get another hit in with that Wyvern, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to. Good for you, Rock. Good for you, Rock. And you, Rindo, you're part of Team Pullback. Okay. So, one of these guys lost their attack up. It was Waltz. So we're gonna... This is true. We are gonna come up here. We're... No, no, no. We're casting a spell. We're casting attack up on Waltz. I guess this is something I wasn't thinking of. Um... With Pappets. I wasn't counting on him to also do damage. And moving Hazuki in here means I can't replace Pappas. But my DPS is gonna go down. If you can come over here and you can steal some thunder off of Mad Garbin and these Giga Breakers, um, keep them alive. I think we're gonna call an audible right now. I'm getting a little a panic with you. Even 10, da 10 damage is something. Now I'm pretty sure David can take a hit. Give me something good, David. You're the leader. Good. Alright, he's got 88. 88. The attack on David is gone. You're gonna attack the Wyvern. And they could all attack the Wyvern here. Um, even What's-His-Face could attack the Wyvern. Uh, and that would be... That, you know what? There's a way where I win right now. If I get a crit, and the Wyvern lives, we might be done. Has Garvin hit? Has Garvin hit? I guess it's all a question of if that Wyvern survives or not. Oh, what? Has Garvin moved? What did Garvin do? 18 agility? Oh, oh wow, did I just get good turn order? So if it's not this turn, it's next turn. Yeah, attack the Wyvern. Uh, do I want you to attack the Wyvern? Oh god, yes I do. Wh what is this? I'll take that not hitting me. Um, 47 damage. So he's gonna have 54 HP when his turn comes up. But that's not insurmountable. Here comes another Bow Knight. Whoa. Okay, this is the Titan. Attack. Oh my god. Um, be careful, Prince Medean. If the tank rolls into someone, they will be severely injured. Alright, so no more bad talking the tank. This is the Giga Breaker. Alright, we're pulling back.
I'm fairly confident we got the battle under control. Like, things can still go wrong. Um... Rock will move before your Rindo, so if I pull Rock back, uh, your Rindo will come with us. That's fine. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh no. Because there's that bow knight, there's... You know, rock. We left rock to die. We left rock to die and not be there in the final fight. This is the Don Terrace of our ages. Alright, here's the other thing. Um, I- this is dumb too. Alright, I'm frazzled now. I thought I had everything under control. And now I'm gonna be going into a final fight rockless. Alright, so, you have 54 HP. Can you swing all the way around, Poppets? No? You can't. So, here's what I'm thinking in my head. Oh wait, you know what I can do though? Who's faster, Pappets or Demon? I think it's- yeah, I think Pappets is faster. Yeah, because I was thinking I could pull David back. So you got 62 attack. I think I'm almost better casting magic. I think I'm almost better casting a spell here. And uh... Is there any reason not to go with Tornado 3? I think this is the, the way we go. Oh, I can't believe I lost Rock. Yeah, we got this. Oh, I can't believe I lost Rock. Just on my own stupidity. A crit here, David. A crit here, David, would be fantastic. I can't believe I lost Rock. I am incredibly disappointed in myself. Man, having Rock for that final battle would be really nice. Um, what are my melee? What a fool I am. I have been defeated by the Median army. We've done it. Garvin has been defeated. Stop the tank at once. But first, we're carrying too much already. I'm gonna give up on the potion. But yes! Through. Oh my god, wait, what? This is not how I remember this battle shaping up. Are you driving over the rock's corpse? The tank, it stopped. Be afraid. The tank stopped. Has David succeeded? David and the other must have defeated Garvin. General Garvin defeated? Don't be foolish. The general could not have been defeated. This... This is a disaster! General Garvin has been defeated. The Median army has stopped the tank. We have lost the battle. That's right. Run away. Go ahead and run! Prince Median, it looks like this battle is over. Ah, oh, good. We have done it. Peace has been restored. My dream is finished. Your dream will not come to pass. If you pursue sinister dreams, the light will push them away from you. My dream has abandoned me. Only being abandoned would have been preferable. 
Your dream has destroyed you. I resurrected this juggernaut. If I had been destroyed, only fitting it should meet the same fate. What are you saying, Garvin? Yes, that would be fitting. To finish with a show. With fireworks. Wait, are you going to blow the tank up? Don't come any closer. It's over, Garvin. We w it's over, Garvin. We won't allow you to do anything rash. I must say, I'm really happy that Garvin is like a, a creature type weird things. What? Y Yasha? No, David. Why, Yasha? Why would you protect Garvin? He's a double agent. Does nobody die in this game? It must be Domeric. Damn him. He knew Garvin's plan. That bastard. Domeric betrayed me. He wanted Aspia. Well, I mean, that makes sense. Is the tank going to start moving again? This is taking too long. David and the others should have emerged by now. What's, what's going on? Inside Aspia's wall has gone silent. They may be deliberating about what to do but I would have expected their forces to be active. Is that the tank? That's the tank. Wait, is it still moving? The tank is reactivated. What is happening? All that for nothing. The rock's death for nothing. We don't know who commands the agent tank or their intentions. Please be careful, Prince Medea. What is happening? Do they have a freaking gun? They have a freaking gun. It's the return of the cannons. How did they conceal such a huge cannon? Perhaps this means Garvin has not been defeated at all. David, you failed. If that cannon were in the line of fire, quick, stand clear. Oh, that was like last minute. We won't be able to capture Garvin with Yasha protecting him. Garvin, what are you doing? Now is the time for the fireworks. Fireworks? What are you talking about? You know, you look kind of like a cat man now. What are you, like a cat snake? Anyway, the Juggernaut's cannon. Cannon? The tank has a cannon? I mean, you would think so. All the bad talk I did for this tank. That could be steel, you know. That could be steel or not wood. What is that sound? The front of the tank is opening. The front of the tank? What is happening? You must be deploying the cannon. Precisely, I kept it stowed away as a last resort. I hoped I wouldn't have to make the sacrifice. Sacrifice? You see, the cannon is damaged and will likely rupture when it's fired. So, I only intended to use it as a last resort. You have forced my hand. But I already shot it, right? So if you fire the cannon, the tank will explode? Do you intend to sacrifice your own life just to take us with you? Aw, uh, look at Penko. Since the beginning, Domeric has been... He's directed us to battle Garvin. All to force him to. Don't fire the cannon, Garvin. Don't fire! That's what Domeric has wanted you to do all along. Destroy Aspia's wall. Oh, he fired. Medea and... Oh no, are they all done? Maybe we're going to have a big battle inside Aspia's walls. Whoa. Poor Rock. What a tremendous shelling. Apparently powerful enough to destroy the tank as well. Prince Median, I'm glad to see you are, you are unharmed. Yeah, everyone else is hurt, but Median's just fine. Everyone appears to have avoided serious injury. We, we were all reeling from that incredible explosion. I wonder if this is the end of Shining Force 3 Scenario 1, where we encounter Symbios on the bridge. I don't see David's battalion anywhere. We can only hope they survived. That exploding tank that they were inside. Garvin must have used the tank's cannon in desperation after his defeat. Aspia and the Median army are worse for it. Are they all okay? Yay, they're all okay. Prince Median, are you alright? What happened to Garvin? Ah, oh, I thought I was going to be torn to pieces by that gigantic cannon. Ow, 
Damn that Garvin. I can't believe he would do that. That bastard. It's a miracle we're alive. Ah, there's dirt in my mouth, but I can't complain. We are very fortunate. I may have survived, but David, I'm worried about David. Oh, Embelsum, thank you for protecting us. Poor Rock, he doesn't even get a, I'm, mm, each limb accounted for, mm, no abnormality. Mm. I'm dizzy, but I'm alright. It seems everyone made it with only minor injuries. Cadaverific! If I had been defeated by cannon fire, I would have been disgraced as a knight. What's happening now? Tybalt. I never expected the Empire to breach Aspia's walls. What are you doing, Tybalt? You accomplished that much, but your lives end here. I will avenge Headland and Swampland, which were occupied by the Empire thanks to you. Wait, what the heck is going on? What, what are you saying? Did we not just stop Garvin from invading Aspia? Words are a convenient thing, aren't they? What happened? Did Garvin fall out of your favor, and now you seek to blame him for everything? Garvin stood by and did nothing while Prince Arant was defeated. But you needed his tank to capture Aspia, so you cooperated with him? Is that it? Tybalt? What's going on, Tybalt? Once his tank has breached the wall for your invasion force, you no longer had a need for him. Perhaps you even killed him yourself. Tybalt, no. Destroying the castle walls with the ancient tank's cannon was an impressive strategy. But King Benetran predicted this would happen. Are you surprised we're prepared? No, guys. That's not what happened at all. Who in the world? Oh, Yasha. This survivor of the Garmin army, Garvin army witnessed your treachery. He surrendered to us and told us what really happened. Oh my god, Yasha just... General Tybalt speaks the truth, but he was just up there with Ara. Oh, there's so many layers. Like an onion. Yasha, how dare you assert such lies? Who are you working for? Who are you working for? It's Domer, isn't it? So that's it. This was all arranged by the Emperor. The Medine army is prominent, even among Imperial armies. To stop your advance, I have borrowed a few elite troops to reinforce the Barand army. Borrowed? Oh, I am bidding of the Snobius army, and now we will end your advance. Oh, I'm fighting these guys! You have betrayed Lord Symbios, who even entrusted you with my brother Zero. It's only right to recompense comes at the hands of the Symbios army. Zero, talk him out of it. No, you've got it all wrong, sister. It's no use. I can't convince her. Will I have to battle my own sister? You are blinded by greed, Median army. Ebelson is not your ally, and now you will face his wrath. For General Edmund, I will protect Aspia. We will not see the capital occupied. You seem surprised the Symbios army stands ready to battle against you. You'll even be more surprised when you realize our strength. I didn't even think this was... Oh my god. Horst. I didn't even think this was Horst. I thought it was the um, stand-in uh, Axeman I hired for this fight. That's how generic you are, Horst. Prince Medea, you are sacrificing your friendship with Lord Symbios. I never knew you to be so unfeeling. These brave heroes who have long served in the Symbios army are second to none. Deal yourselves, you imperial bastards. Bastards! You have betrayed the trust of Lord Symbios and his army. I can't forgive you for that. Please stop, soldiers of the Symbios army. This is a misunderstanding. We don't want to invade Aspia. Oh, dude, I'm fighting them? It's too late. You can't explain away your actions. Prepare to die, Midian army. What's really weird is, um... I think I was at a higher level on Scenario 1 than I am now. Uh, let's see... Oh, wow, you're just... Diving right in. Is this just the army? Oh, there's a Giga Break. Oh, the giant armor. And a sorcerer. And, uh. Is that it? Oh, we got Pegasus Knights. We got giant armors. We got Yasha. Yasha's pretty deadly. Tybalt's the deadliest. Rock did not come back to life. Nope. Um, 
So Eldar. Eldar has 48. Eldar. Is that a bastard sword? I swore I had... I, uh... I swore. Swore, 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 swore. We had better stuff than that. Finding has a foil. Oh, Finding has the beak too. The sorcerers were scary. Mirza, Mirza same. You're... You're... You're weak. Khan is weak. Well, Khan is super weak. I know Justin. Wow, Justin's like super duper weak. Yeah, alright, we're gonna... I feel really bad that we are gonna slaughter these poor... Our poor friends in the Symbios army are gonna meet a terrible and tragic end on this battlefield. And, uh... We'll see how we do it. I think we have two videos before the end of this one. Uh, because while I think I could finish this one in a single stream, I think the ending's gonna be a bit long, so we'll try to save one for the ending. Anyway, if you're here and you've been on the whole journey with me, thank you. And we'll see this to the end soon.